Oh no. Oh no. So this is the energy diagram for the endothermic reaction. Notice how the minimum energy required for a reaction to occur is labeled Ea, or the activation energy. And the difference in energy between the reactants and products is delta H. In this case, it's positive, it's endothermic. Once again, the minimum energy required for a reaction to occur is labeled Ea, activation energy. But notice now the difference between the energy of the reactants and the products. Well, that's going to be negative, so delta H is negative. We're going down all the way here. And so that means exothermic.